guys, it's Charlotte and today's video is going to be on how I make sushi and I have a special little tool that helps me make my sushi called the Sushi Bazooka. No, this is not sponsored. I wish it was because I love the Sushi Bazooka. But I'm really excited to take you guys along with me today while I make sushi. If you guys follow me on my Instagram story or on Snapchat, you know that I'm addicted to sushi and I make it like all the time so I thought it was about time that I made a video showing you guys how to make it so let's jump right into the recipe so first we are going to start out with my favorite sushi rice and I have an even bigger bag of this by my cupboards I seriously love it so first step is we're gonna take a half a cup of this and put it into my rice maker And for half a cup of rice for my rice maker, I put in a little over a cup of water. I know that some people like to use quinoa or brown rice for their sushi, but for me, it's just like too much trouble because you have to add a bunch of ingredients to make it sticky. So I just use the regular white sushi rice. While the rice is cooking, we're gonna prep my avocado. This one is a small organic avocado. And we're just going to cut it into slices for the sushi. I'm not too finicky with how many ingredients I put in. Usually I just like avocado and cucumber. And I'm gonna sound so stupid, but I honestly only found out like yesterday how to get the avocado out of an avocado when you cut it. Before I would like try to rip the skin off and it would always end up in a mess. But now I realize that you can just take a spoon and easily guide it out of the avocado. I'm done. Just in time for my video though. And this probably goes without saying, but I'm just going to chop the cucumber into little slices to put in the sushi. Once the rice is ready, we're just going to turn it off and look at that delicious steamy rice. Now comes my amazing sushi bazooka. So all I gotta do is just put almost all of the half a cup of rice into the sushi bazooka. It's like right in between a third of a cup to a half a cup I use. So I always have a little bit of leftover rice, but that's okay. And I just put the cucumber in there, the avocado, and then we're gonna add my favorite ingredient, which is the hummus. It tastes so good in sushi. And today I'm actually using sabra hummus, but I usually made homemade, but I didn't have any prepped yet. Then I just close up the sushi bazooka and press it down a bit on the top with a knife to make sure everything is secure and doesn't fall out and it's literally that simple. You just close it up and it makes sushi so easy. Then you just put your seaweed on a flat plate and you press out the sushi onto the seaweed. It's so amazing. I seriously am obsessed with this contraption because it makes sushi so quick and I make it like every day. Then you just simply roll the sushi, so much easier to roll now. And then when it's basically all covered, I like to take a basting brush and just wipe it with some water and that helps it stick easier. Alrighty, so now we are just going to cut the sushi. I actually didn't do the greatest job of cutting it today, so we're not going to show all that. But <laughs> yeah, I, and you can already see your delicious sushi pieces forming. To finish it off and make it restaurant style, we are just going to put some black sesame seeds on there. And now I'm just going to pour some coconut aminos into a wooden bowl with my favorite hot sauce, sriracha. And let me tell you, this is the best combo. And we are done, and it's time to eat. So I have a special way of eating my sushi. I of course use chopsticks, and first you dip it in the coconut aminos or soy sauce, and then just dip it in the sriracha. Don't mix it together, dip it, and it makes a huge difference and is so good. Hey everyone, I really hope you enjoyed today's recipe video. Please let me know in the comments if you decide to try it out and what you thought of the video. Don't forget to subscribe, a thumbs up, and turn on my YouTube notifications 
for more recipe videos, lifestyle videos, music videos, basically everything on this channel. Okay guys, thanks again. See you later. <laughs>